The word something means a thing that is not known or not named. For example, there is something in the box, but I don't know what it is. Similarly, someone refers to a person whose identity we do not know. For instance, someone is knocking at the door. These are examples of indefinite pronouns with some. They are indefinite pronouns because they don't refer to a specific thing, person, or place. Indefinite pronouns that come after a negative verb are made with the word any. These are the indefinite pronouns with the word any. Anything. Anyone. Anybody. Anywhere. For example, I can't find anywhere to sit. With the word every, the indefinite pronouns are everything, everyone, everybody, and everywhere. And with the word no, the indefinite pronouns are nothing, no one, nobody, and nowhere. Indefinite pronouns are singular. Notice the singular verbs in these two sentences. Someone wants to come in. Everyone likes Peter. We often use these pronouns with to and a verb, like in these sentences. Let's have something to drink. Let's go out and find somewhere to eat. We also often use them with adjectives. For example, let's find somewhere cheap to eat. And there's nowhere cheap near here. Lastly, we use indefinite pronouns with the word else, for instance, Let's go somewhere else. In this sentence, somewhere else means somewhere different or a different place. Else means different. Else can also mean more or extra, like in this sentence. Would you like something else?